Hi, this is Lauren Parsons, and this video is to show you how to use the Zoom app. So once you've installed Zoom, you can actually click through to the app from the icon on your taskbar if it's pinned there. And these are the key things you can do from the home page. First one is that you can click to join a meeting. So if someone has sent you the nine digit code for a meeting, for example, you can paste it straight in here and then click the join button and that will take you through to that meeting. The other thing you can do is to schedule a meeting. So here you can schedule meetings for a future time and date. You can label it whatever you want to call your meeting. And then you can set the day that it's going to happen, the time of day, and the duration. So it could be a one hour meeting, one hour and a 30 minute meeting. You can even shorten it down to just a 30 minute meeting. If, however, you want this to be a recurring meeting, you're going to have this XYZ meeting on a regular basis, you can click this button, it will remove the set time and date, and you can use this unique ID code for this meeting on a regular basis at any time you like, and you can set up a calendar invitation to give you the timings. Now with the ID code, there's always a 9 or 10 digit numerical code, which can either be your normal personal meeting ID or you can generate one just for this specific meeting or these recurring meetings. It will generate a password as well. And when you set the meeting up and share the link, it will give your participants the meeting ID and password together. Now you can change the settings. You can make your video come on or off. You can make participants' videos come on or off. So for example, if you want to have your participants sharing their videos, then it's a good idea to have them come on from the start. You can also change the audio settings where you have the option for people to dial in if they're in the United States. Normally you leave this as it is. You can also change it if you'd like it to send to your Google Calendar or another calendar. So then you click Schedule and it will take a moment to set up and schedule that meeting. What it can do in the background is then open up a window with the email invitation so that you can send that out. You can see down here my email has actually now got this Zoom meeting. So it's asking me to enter the recipient's details in and it has got the link here, which you'll see has got the Zoom join link and then question mark and then the password code for them to access the meeting. So now I can set the time and if it's a recurring meeting, I can go in and create the recurrence that I want as I would with any other online meeting. Then the third thing you can do in here is to just launch a meeting. So if you're just wanting to start a meeting and then invite people to join you straight away, just click new meeting and it will open here. I'll just maximize that. And so then it will invite you to join with computer audio. So now you're in a normal meeting, and as I've shown you in my other video, you can now mute or unmute. You can start video or stop video at any point. Hi there, how's it going? You can also use things like the chat function in the center here to chat in the side. At the top, when you have participants there, you'll be able to change between speaker view and gallery view. And the other key thing you can do if you've just launched this meeting and want to invite someone is to click here on invite. And from here, you can either send it out to contacts if you've entered contacts into your Zoom details, or you can simply copy the URL or copy the full invitation. So you can usually the best thing is just to copy the URL, send that out, and that will go out to the person that you want to link in with you. They can click the link and join in. If you haven't already mastered all of the settings in Zoom and how to use them, then do check out my other video on that. But hopefully this helps you to understand how you can use that app to schedule meetings, to start a meeting or join someone else's meeting. Hope this gives you lots of success using Zoom. I'm Lauren Parsons. Thanks for watching.